Hi everyone, thanks once again for tuning in to Smash Factor TV. My name's Natalie Adams. Today's video tip, we're going to stop you coming over the top and get you hitting much straighter, much further golf shots with some more game-changing golf coaching. Okay, so with this video tip, we're going to look at how to stop you coming over the top. All you're going to need for that is uh, your driver head cover or one of your hybrids, your fairway woods. And we've got two alignment poles here. So I'm just going to use the red one on the ground as the target line. Then what I want to do with the other alignment pole, again, if you've not got an alignment pole, a garden cane, or you could use a, uh, an umbrella would be absolutely uh, fine. If I set up, doesn't matter which club I'm holding, just set up to the golf ball and then with this pole just on the outside of my right foot I want to push that pole into the ground there really so it's going to replicate the angle of the club here when I've got this head cover on the top. So I'm just going to feed that head cover onto the top there there we go and it'll just pull down a little bit and then I can just adjust that a little bit just to flatten it off okay now this is a really good drill so you can actually hit golf balls doing this uh, obviously if you're on the practice ground you can push the alignment poles into the ground if you're practicing at home at the moment again with the lawn no problem uh, the range just use uh, uh, the range basket turn it upside down so that you can angle that pole in and all we're going to do here is you're going to make your backswing and on the downswing if you're coming over the top you're going to go this way so you're going to clip this head cover or you're even going to come down in front of that head cover so the idea with this is to get the feeling here of you're going to swing to the top and then as you swing back down get the lower body moving first i'll put a link into the uh, video here to help you with that because a big issue with coming over the top would be that you swing to the top and then your first movement will come from your upper body, turning your chest and your, uh, your upper body area towards the ball. If we're going to stop that over the top move, we need to get the lower body moving first and we need to get the hands back underneath uh, this pole without hitting that head cover. You can actually hit balls uh, when you're doing that but just to start with just make some practice swings getting used to that feeling of moving the lower body turning the pelvis towards the target the upper body being a bit delayed and the hands working back and underneath that head cover rather than out in front. Once you've got the feeling of that, just do it slowly to start with, and then you can start to speed it up. Start to make some full speed uh, swings without the golf ball, and then once you're doing that more regularly without hitting and clipping uh, this head cover, then start to introduce the golf ball in. Again, to start with, you might just want to swing very slowly and just hit some very short shots but you can build the speed up until you can hit the ball and swing at full speed without hitting that head cover. But it's a great feedback drill. You're going to hit the golf ball a lot straighter and you're going to hit it further. It's another game-changing golf tip.